<laughs> Comedy Now, starring Peter Kalamas. Please welcome Peter Kalamas. If you're looking for uh, cheap liquor, and hey, who isn't? The airport. If you're ever flying from here to the States, uh, you get to take advantage of the duty-free shop on your way down. Unbelievable. Uh, you can't miss it. Big sign. Uh, duty-free slash, and then the French, horse tax. <laughs> How many confused Americans walked by that sign the first time? We gotta pay some kind of whore tax for crying out loud. <laughs> when I fell asleep at the hotel, you didn't go downtown and do any whoring, did you, miss? Come on. Don't go back to the States, we'll tell the friends. You save 30 cents on the dollar, but they get you with the whore tax at the airport. <laughs> just when you're leaving, just like Mexico. <laughs> yeah, you think you're done. Bam, whore tax. <laughs> yep, good for them. The uh, whore tax. Because it's Canada, it gets chilly up there, the whores need jackets, mittens, what have you. So I had some uh, McDonald's the other day. I, I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> to me, eating McDonald's is just kind of like sleeping with someone you shouldn't have. You wake up the next morning, you're like, what the hell did I do that for? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yeah, and, and then you just avoid them for months. <laughs> and then one night you come out of a bar hammered at 2 a.m. and you're like, I need some booty! <laughs> Don't try to stop me! Smokers in the crowd, uh, let me hear you. Oh, my gosh. Right over here, was it, sir? Have you spoken for a long time? A couple of years? Oh, only a couple of years. So you started when the big gruesome uh, warning things were on there. <laughs> that didn't deter you at all? But I, don't, I don't get it, though. I just, I don't, why don't they just take the same mentality trying to prevent crime? You know, put a big poster outside of a 7-Eleven. Got a bunch of guys outside of there. It's like, okay, at the count of three, we're putting on the ski masks, we're going in. One, two. <laughs> Look at that poster of that guy getting boned by a cellmate. <laughs> Maybe we should just get jobs. That would be better. <laughs> hey, uh, you got some spare time tomorrow. You want to piss someone off? Go to Starbucks, look for the new guy, and order a medium. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm only laughing because I did that to the kid. <laughs> I the one by where I live, and just, you can spot him a mile away that he's new. You know, looks like a quail, you know. <laughs> can I take your order? <laughs> yeah, beaker. Um, Get a medium coffee, please. I think you, you got to get a grande or a vente. <clears throat> yeah, just a medium's good.
All right, so you gotta call my manager. <laughs> I'll be here. I just hate places that impose their language on us, you know? Make us pronounce uh, shit the, the way they want, you know? Grande vente, what the hell? You know who else is really bad for that? Huh? Ikea. I, I can't, first off, Ikea freaks me out. How many, how many times you go to Ikea, you need nothing. You need nothing. No, they put that impulse buy shit in the aisles. You can't help yourself. You're walking by, it just... <laughs> Tea candles. Pack of a hundred for four ninety five. <laughs> get a couple of those just in case. What the, just in case what? When's the last time your neighbor came rapping on your door? Jesus Christ! You got any tea candles? <laughs> yes. How many do you need? Ninety-eight. I got a hundred. I got a hundred. And who, who designed the layout for Ikea? Then they got an architect and a psychologist. We want them to enter, but we don't want them to leave. You ever tried to get the hell out of an Ikea quick? Every now and then they tempt your little hand on the wall. Oh, we're going back, we're going back, we're going back. <laughs> We've been here for hours. I'm hungry. We have food. <laughs> As I, you, you find something in Ikea, you think you can pronounce it? <laughs> you think that's called a bar stool? <laughs> that's a... Flakertin! Oh, God! Mind packing up a couple of Dirtin Hawkins for me, please? Oh, they're not here? We're downstairs. How do I get downstairs? 